Weapons case over here. Oh, just me. Puta madre. ¿Qué les pasa, wey? Ah. I may not be totally fluent, but I know enough. Come on. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Come on. There we go. I can do it. In case any of you hadn't noticed, I've been playing this a lot off stream, but I figured I might as well go online. Nice job. I'll ping the chopper's location to the rebels. What's up, Yosef, William, Taco? I did not choose the thug life. Oh yes, William, I did. I apologize. Um, I'll, I'll, I promise to be able to send that to you tonight. But I did get your email address. Oops. Yeah, I'm enjoy I'm having a lot of fun with it. Uh, I would say, Ethan, it's bet at twenty bucks for the base game. It's definitely worth it. I only paid the base game. I didn't get the gold edition or season pass or anything like that. What do we got here? I got a Sicario with a minigun at the 
Nailed it. Spotting another tango. Got another tango. Yo, cartel gunman, by that mortar. Ooh. I found their people. Oh shit! The alarm. What the hell are you doing? Oh, oh fuck. Oh wow, a lot of prisoners here. In the old days, the miners made sure to leave offerings to a deal down in the tunnels. Little things, some tobacco or a handful of coca leaves. Sometimes, if the men knew they would be working a shaft that had an evil reputation, they would pour out cups of singani over the stones, so a deal would leave them be. The year I turned 25, I was working in a mine near Huayna. It was old and deep. The timbers were rotted and its veins were nearly dry. What's up, Oscar? Come on, mijo. How are you, man? We had been working in the deepest part of the mine for many weeks. And the tunnels had begun to shift and ground. I knew that El Tio was hungry and that something bad was going to happen. So my brother and I went into the hills one night and killed a llama. That morning, before I went We've got a possible location on DJ Perico's radio station. Go check it out. Well, I, I I appreciate that hype beast gaming. No homo. <laughs> Yeah, William, I can't wait for that one. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Five days before amazing happens. What's up, Shadow? The drone is up. The signal's all bad. They're jamming the drone. Oh, nah. <laughs> I don't know how long. It, well, they say it's about 20 hour, 20 or 30 hours of gameplay in uh, God of War. I don't know. Are you talking about? Um, 
closing in on the radio station. Let's see if Perico's on the job. You talk about this game. I got eyes on a mouse weapon. Looks like the pillow broke. Watch your step. These guys know something's up. This place is empty. Maybe he ran. Maybe somebody we talked to tipped him off. But he's still broadcasting. Bowman, we're at the station. DJ Perico isn't here, but there's still a broadcast coming through. He's using that station as a relay to boost his signal, and we can't hack in without the encryption key. Use the drone to scan his antennas. Sigan can take incoming data, and we can try to trace his location by triangulating the incoming signal strength. Roger All I understood from that phone call with Bowman was we just have to keep the drone still until the scanning's done. I'm opening fire. We're nice, Getting we're some nice. awful interference here. Not good. Might be a jammer in the area. You're gonna have to find and destroy that before you can scan Perico's antennas. We're on it. Cover! Get to cover! What's up, Alpha? Pretty good. Still working. Ah! It's still going strong. Taking a bit of a breather for the time being. I went to law school in Rhode Island, uh, Ethan. Roger Williams University. Ah, oh, I hear it. There it is. Demo's primed and in place. You're oh, John, you're at Providence? Nice. Yeah, I lived in Rhode Island for three years while I was in law school, so. <clears throat> I think that's all of them. So I gotta climb up up top there? Oh, I just gotta bring the drone up there at least. Alright, easy enough. Nice. Scan complete. An old Rhode Island red, huh? Rhode Island bread, I should say. Where are all the felines? 
Yeah, I got back to being cold again, Shadow, so I'm kind of cold in the house. Well, one of the cats is at the litter box. I can hear him. I don't know where the other one is. Here it is. You're in Tennessee. Gotcha. We get the chance, we'll take out the convoy before it reaches Swainio's personal shrine. Good news. Thanks to those schematics you found in the scan you took, we've confirmed that Perico's using a basic frequency agility program to encrypt the signal to his relay. But to hijack the signal for Pat Katari's broadcast, we still need the encryption key. Right. We've got enough data to get you to the area of Perico's location. You need to pay him an unfriendly visit and get his encryption key. Bowman sending through background on DJ Perico. I don't know everything about the game. His dream in life was to be a mixtape DJ, which essentially means yelling over someone else's song and then charging people for it. Huh. Fortunately for the music industry, life got in the way. Corner boy at age 13, crack charge at 14, attempted murder at 15. Rather than do a bit in a gladiator academy, he fled to Mexico. He had a cousin in Santa Blanca, got a job as a Sicario, a hitman. However, if Santa Blanca had run a sheet, they'd have seen he'd only attempted murder. Another way of saying he was a fuck up. Like he missed two guys in the front seat of a Wrangler. I mean, how hard is that? It was only a matter of time before he annoyed the shit out of every single member of the cartel and got his corpse thrown back across the border, except El Sueño took a liking to him. Carrico amused him. He can't shoot a gun, but he can shoot his mouth off. So, good morning, Bolivia! El Sueño found a role for him. Pirate radio, propaganda. Spread the good word about the coming of Santa Blanca. It's a beautiful day for cocaine, but hey... What day is it? A special shout out to my boys in Pucara province, building in Swain's <laughs> final finca. Well, let's not be in too big a hurry, okay, boys? DJ Perico is El Sueño's pet. Let's give him something new to parrot. Hmm. Swainu is sending a convoy loaded with personal items to decorate his... No, I don't want to know the end, Shadow. You heard that right. Intercept and destroy those trucks. Oh, I'm fucked! Shit! Uh, what are you talking about, depression? It's a Mountain Dew. I know you hear the cats. They're somewhere around here.
It's a one bedroom apartment, William. Tiny. Nothing special. Who's next? All right, so I can't go there by air. They got they have uh, anti-aircraft. So, um, I guess I'll drive. All right. I asked the rebels to send over a vehicle for us. <laughs> nice. I'll drive. There it is. There's the anti-aircraft uh, battery. Yo, we got a cartel LT at the entrance to the camp. What's up, John? How are you, man? No worries. Hey, you got family stuff. So, totally understandable, you know? I'm in. Let's go. Fire. I got
Come on, take out the chopper. Yeah, John, you're not the only one. And it sucks. Because it, I get the same issue too whenever I try to follow other streamers who go online. That I'm not getting the notifications either. And honestly, it's been an issue for YouTube for God knows how many years now, and it's getting on everybody's nerves. Oh shit! Hopefully my teammates can revive me! Hurry up, bro! Thanks. Oh yeah, John, no doubt. I've been trying my best not to read all the reviews to avoid, you know, as uh, the spoilers, but... I can't wait. Yeah, uh, they've been like singing high praises for it, like the best game of the generation, best game ever on P, you know, best game on PS4. Never mind game of the year. Hey, Ethan, thank you for that $1 super chat, man. Yeah. Well, the game at the end of the at the end of the game at the end of the cutscene. Oh shit, I'm dead. Uh it implied that while Kratos stabbed himself, he like crawled over the water into the water. Who knows what the hell that means? All right. Try this again. I played God of War 3 and Ascension. Those are the only ones I've ever played. I've never played 1 or 2. Come on! Oh shit!
Fuck! What the hell? Oh my god. That was bad. That was stupid of me. I got too, um... Too impatient. Come on, come on. Roger that, the target marked. Tango is fucking down. There we go. Okay, we're still alright. Deploying drone. We're good to go. I got a target carrying submachine guns. Gun of the Tango. Enemy spotted. Alright, those are the three up there. Fucking drunk ass. No, but uh, without an upgrade that I already got, um, they were able. They could hear it. Like they could see the drone. They could see the drone, but I, it has to be right in front of their faces. Just realize that this thing is fucking armored. This is a fucking armored, an armored uh, construction vehicle. Holy fuck! Shit. I'm open to position. Let me find a good position. Target acquired. Go down. Whew, that was close.
get into position. Move it to a better position. Copy. Target marked. Roger that. I don't have a shot. Carajo! That's gonna get me demonetized. I've never played a whole lot of Ghost Recon. Or even a Rainbow Six in general. Oh shit. There we go. Whew! Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, I, the way I've described uh, Recon uh, Wildlands so far is that it's a much, much more tactical version of Far Cry. But the kind of premise is the same. It's like liberate the, re liberate the area region by region. But it's much, much more tactical. Uh, yeah, Ethan, I'm sure you can hear the cat there. Who dat? Hey, Sulphur, how are you, man? No, I haven't, uh, William. I know you mentioned it to me, but I hadn't seen it yet. Roger that. Move it. I need a better position. I got it. I'm moving to position. 
position. Got the target. Ready to engage. Lost the target. Of course, if I have the opportunity to wear a cowboy hat while taking out fucking narco terrorists, I'm going to wear the cowboy hat. Lost my target. Copy. Target marked. Oh, they 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 suspect something now. Yo, I got a weapons case here. Oh, who the fuck? Shit. Marked. Jingao, bitch. Clear. How you guys holding up? Huh. Made it through. This will go nice with my boots. It's like I'm in Texas back again with this uh, Tejano. Yep. Uh, I'm on just normal difficulty. Really? We're gonna try to pull that shit? This is a mausoleum they're building for this fucking, uh, cartel's leader. El Sueño. For God's sakes, what a fucking ego. Get that little fucker and make 
can give up his We're clear on this side. Shit. I've seen a mausoleum or two in my time. This one could eat those for breakfast and not even notice when it shit them out. We're supposed to think Sweeney has a guard? He sure as hell does. There's the antenna. Rico's gotta be close. Remember, we need him alive, people. What's up, bitch? You ain't fucking shit, man. So? At a loss for words, DJ. Hey, hey, look at me. Do I look like a psychiatrist to you? You don't have to kill me, man. Oh yeah? Why is that? I still got my whole life to live, man. Don't we all? <laughs> Biddy bum. Biddy biddy bum bum. Oh my God, he's dropping Selena. This is the day I spared you. Okay. See, I know you can just change the encryption key, but in exchange for not killing you, you are gonna keep broadcasting, and you're gonna wait to change that password until my associate Pakatari makes his broadcast. You got it. Got the encryption key, but I'm not sure we're up for hacking the signal. I know you're not techies. The rebels gave us the location of one of their comms guys. You have to break him out of a Santa Blanca jail, but we need his expertise. You can't spare a comms guy who isn't locked up. And neither can I. Extract him to an RP, and I'll get him the gear he needs to cut into that broadcast for Pakatari. Roger that. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up these supplies later. Here we go. Atari's radio engineer is being held prisoner at the Oliko Dam. We need to bust this guy out so he can help us hack Perico's broadcasting system. I'm fucking famous, man. I got it. I'll fly. Yep, <laughs> simply it's open world. I thought I took out the Sam. I I thought I took out the Sam battery. Apparently I forgot or something. I don't know. Oh, don't tell me! Um, I'm wearing a vest. Hang on, I'll show you. Uh, 
uh, on a scale of 1 to 20, I'm definitely at a, uh, I'm definitely at a 15. Maybe even higher. No, I don't have to restart. I already took care of that mission. Hey guys, what's going on? On a scale of 1 to 20, I'd probably rate Skyrim like 19. You know, mo with uh, with mods, I'd rate Skyrim on a 19 or 20 even. You're doing what now? Oh, oh, I, I thought I was going to answer you. Hang on, here. See, I'm wearing a full vest, but I'm wearing like a casual shirt and a combat pair of jeans. Yes, I think you have already. Oh, you mean my my clothes? Yeah, it, the the weather got a lot colder than yesterday and Friday. That's why I'm wearing uh wearing them. friend Pakatari sent us. Está bueno. Let's go. Come on, dude. We got 
tangos, danger close. We got a Sicario next to the checkpoint. It's fine. Heads up, we got a turret. I got eyes and a mounted weapon. Got another tango. Okay, we're still good. Archer. Here we go. Shit! 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 I got one of my guys just goes in the trunk. Akakatari is my senior commandante, but I did not think he would call upon Americans just to rescue little me. You have some technical expertise that's pertinent to our current mission. Fuck, 
fire, fire, fire. Puta madre. Oh shit. Oh, what the fuck? Who was that? Sulfur? Hey, thanks a lot, man. Whoa, whoa 20. <laughs> I, I said it again. 20 euro, 20 euro <laughs> super chat. Thank you very much. I almost said 20 pound euro. <laughs> Thank you, man. Thank you very much, man. Much appreciated. Sulfur, that's uh, very generous of you. $20 pound euros. <laughs> Everybody give props to, uh, Sulphur for his uh, awesome generosity, and, uh, that means a lot to me, man. I appreciate it. <sighs> Alright, that's getting me hot now. <sighs> Thank you again. This broadcast could be a greater victory than any of us realize. Or it could change nothing. Carajo, don't worry. I will get it done and then we shall see. Adios, pues. Stay tuned to Santa Blanca Radio. If all goes to plan, you'll hear Pakatari's speech before you know it. Who are? Oh, well. Much appreciated again, man. DJ Perico is already a fool, but now Sueño looks like one too. How do you measure the reactions we get anyway? When they're not busy taking selfies. My social media team monitors online trends. Hashtag DJ Perico is already getting the funniest gifts. Boom and out. Our rebel tech is getting cozy with Bowman. Hang on. A conscience is a dangerous thing. Mostly to the person who has one. Ramon Feliz couldn't live with himself. He was moments from taking the coward's way out when... It seems that in spite of his recent allegiance to us, Feliz still had one source who was willing to bring him information. Un chivato. Information I was now aware of since I had people monitoring his every keystroke. It's a shame, really, if Ramon had known what was on its way. He would have gone through with the suicide. Oh, fuck. Bowman wants the rebel to feel like this is their off. Shit, they're the ones getting the credit for it anyway. Let's keep moving. Get your team ready to move. There's a popular Bolivian blogger, Ramon Feliz, who's been working for the cartel. He usually writes about Santa Blanca's charity events and shit. Well, for that amount of money, that amount of euro, yeah. I got it. I'll fly. 
Ramon Feliz has turned whistleblower and has revealed the existence of a child trafficking ring run by the cartel. Get to Feliz and find out what he knows before El Sueño has him killed. Perico and the cartel are pretending that nothing happened, but that rebel broadcast did a lot to inspire the locals. The word from Pacatari is that people are lining up to join the fight against Santa Blanca. Let's hope it was the right play. I get nervous when any player in the game gets too strong. Afraid the socialists are gonna get too big for their britches? He's such a cool war antique. This is the CIA in Latin America. Oh fuck! It's gonna blow. Aqueduct? I'll be damned. Check this spot out for intel. Uh, should be, yeah. Uh, sulfur. I know, right? I'm taking the bike. Biblioteca. What's up, Malik? Of course, there'd be a freaking slot machine in a freaking library. Oh, balls! Get to the chopper! Run! Where was I going in the first place? Oh yeah, over here. Ramon Feliz has turned whistleblower and has revealed the existence of a child trafficking ring run by the cartel. Get to Felice and find out what he knows before El Sueño has him killed. Let me see if I can take this one down like I can in Far Cry.
Guess not. Sam Fisher, hey! <laughs> Security. Worked with Fisher on a KR in South America. Said he was a real hard ass. But reliable as hell. But not a guy you invited for dinner with the family. Guess he's had it rougher than most. Lost both his parents when he was a kid. And apparently, somebody faked his daughter's death. He's been shot, stabbed, tortured. That bastard's still ticking. Like Rasputin or something. And that takes something powerful. To keep at it after all that shit happens to you. The Fisher has spent decades walking side by side with death. That's tough. Sometimes. You have to think about the bad things we do for the good of our country. We travel overseas, take some lives, ruin others. And I'd do it all again. In a heartbeat. But I still don't know if I'd go as far as Sam Fisher does. Holy fuck! This is why criminals are fucking stupid. You'll always find the one guy who's going to tweet himself uh, uh, at the scene of the crime. Or admitting to the crime on social media. Shut down the car. Shut down the car. There we go. Oh, fuck! I think I just sliced them up with the, uh, the helicopter rotors. It was at this moment that he knew. <laughs> I'll be right back. Gotta go to the room. 
restroom. Mm. Hold on. Archer. Original Billy Badass himself, Sam Fisher, is in the crew. Bowman, we're in Florida Oro. The trees there may be pretty, but that province is the heart of Unidad corruption. We want to break up the love affair between Unidad and the cartel. That means taking down General Barrow. The commander of Unidad. How hard is he to get to? We've got no leads on the general's location, but we've got word of a data center at Unidad's mob Jaguar. Our source tells us it's chock full of informed personnel. It may even tell tales about some of the city that's less than savory operations. Sounds like a good place to find leads on General Barrow. I'm sending you the location of Mob Jaguar now. They probably got the data center underground to keep it cool. And our source couldn't get us any password access, so you'll have to hack in. <laughs> Major General Barro is a patriot. He runs UNO, the Bolivian military police force, the main operating base Jaguar in Florida Oro. When Santa Blanca first arrived in Bolivia, there was a war with him death. Innocent civilians got caught in a crossfire, but the death toll was tremendous. Barro had seen a lot of death in his life and was desperate to bring peace back to his country. So he brokered a backroom deal between El Sonio and the Bolivian government. Mooney Dad agreed to look the other way and let Santa Blanca run their business. In exchange, the cartel promised to keep their feelings to a minimum. Obviously, the results have been a mixed bag. The relationship between Santa Blanca and Mooney Dad is tense. Now that Bolivia has become a full-fledged narco state, I believe that he is starting to regret his decision. <laughs> Major General Barro is either one of our most dangerous enemies or our greatest ally. There's only one way to find out which. It's still, I've noticed that it is pretty glitchy sometimes. Not too, nothing too crazy, but it's there.
my feet dry. <laughs> what, eating chips? I'm hungry, okay? Sue me. This is gonna suck. If I'm gonna end up being doing a stealth mission where I can't kill anybody... Jammed. What's up, Brom? No joke, how the fuck am I going to do this? Oh my god, this is impossible! I can't kill anybody, this is bullshit!
Really? Really? He's in there. on Matchwood. So, you're what a ghost looks like, huh? This is ha! the way you stole a whole lot of serious intel out of Langley. Scuttlebutt is trying to sell it to Santa Blanca. Santa Blanca? He's selling to them what's he doing in the unit day camp. I'm thinking he's trying to buy protection. Huh. Didn't work out too well for him, did it? He got exactly what he's doing. Let's have a look what we got. <laughs> Happened, Sulphur. Son of a bitch. What? Put the Langley intel on the unit dead server. Now, I can hack this. But the problem is, as soon as I open that door, we're going to have a whole lot of I need you up top, pull on the bridge. Look, the problem is, is this is going to take some time. I gotta hack the server, download the Langley files, and then bleach the hard drive. Look, if that shows up, you turn on that faucet. Where are you coming? Right, just keep him busy. This will take a minute. All right. Oh, wow, level four. Oh, shit. Come on, teammates. Where are my teammates? would be better. We got a sniper, get down. No! 
Oh no, please don't tell me I have to do that again. Please don't tell me I have to do that again. Fuck! 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 I said we got hostiles in the area. Yo, eyes on the ground. Nomad, this is Matchwood. This is Nomad. Go ahead. I'm in position. Here are my coordinates. Remember. Don't be seen, don't be heard, and don't drop any bodies. Hey, Mike. Sorry. My bad. I don't know why I'm so loud. about now we got a grunt all by his lonesome over by that stack of tires por qué no se reportó ayer qué ocurrió Fucking hell. I didn't die. I failed the mission because I, because I killed the guy. If apparently knocking him out means a lethal knockout, not a non-lethal takedown. Back it up. 
right now I'm using uh, the AK-12, M40A5, and M1911. Sulfur, another 10 euro from you. Thank you, but fucking hell. Worst fucking timing ever. on matchwood it was a dollar euro so nice you're what a ghost looks like huh who's our friend this is the cia gone rogue stole a whole lot of serious intel out of langley scuttlebutt is trying to sell it to santa blanca santa blanca uh-huh if he's selling to them what's he doing in the unit day camp i'm thinking he's trying to buy protection huh didn't work out too well for him did it he got exactly what he deserved of course he did, Silver. Of course he did. Son of a bitch. What? Put the Langley intel on a unit that server. Now I can hack this. There, on the bridge. The problem is, as soon as I open that door, we're going to have a whole lot of undesirables come look for dangles. What do you need from me? I need you up top pulling security. Look, the problem is, is this is going to take some time. I gotta hack the server, download the Langley files, and then bleach the hard drive. Look, here the dead shows up, you turn on the lead faucet. You are. Enemy incoming. Right, just keep him busy. This will take a minute. Rally up, people. We ran out somebody's cage. <laughs> No, fuck me! There goes my one. How does it feel? I mean, normal. I never really played a whole lot of Splinter Cell, honestly. Faster would be better. We got a fucking man down. We got a man, man down. down. Yo, man down. Are you kidding me? Ah! What the fuck? Damn it! Nomad, this is Matchwood. This is Nomad. Go ahead. I'm in position. 
Here are my coordinates. Remember, don't be seen, don't be heard, and don't drop any bodies. Yo, we got hostiles. Hey, I don't need that soldier. There, at the checkpoint. on me. Copy. We got a grunt all by his lonesome. Near that stack of tires. Deploying drone. Can't see squat. Drone's being jammed. Nomad, go ahead. I'm in position. Here are my coordinates. Remember, don't be seen, don't be heard, and don't drop any bodies. Sniper, top of the tower. ¿Qué trae en mente? Soldier, over by that stack of tires. Es que acá las cosas ya habíamos quedado 45 bolivianos, compa. Sus compas están mamados, ni siquiera se pueden dar cuenta. Si yo me quedo en casa, si ya no la veo usted, no voy a ver a otra, a otra persona. He's talking to his mother. 
¿Cómo está mamá? ¿Qué le preocupa? ¿Qué trae en mente? Hey, Gilbert. targets. Nomad, go ahead. I'm in position. Here are my coordinates. Remember, don't be seen, don't be heard, and don't drop any bodies. 
This is bullshit! Sniper, top of the tower. Oh, come on! God damn it! I can do this. Hey, I don't need that soldier. Nomad, this is Matchwood. This is Nomad. Go ahead. I'm in position. Here are my coordinates. Remember, don't be seen, don't be heard, and don't drop any bodies. Stack of tires. Sniper up in the tower. We need to add bird approaching. Stay down. Here's target number five.
can't I have like knockout darts or something? Fuck. Eyes on Matchwood. They're gonna make you back up. God damn it! Come on! Fuck! 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 That's fine, Mike, except I can't kill anybody! Using silencers just makes no fucking difference! I can't kill anyone! If I could kill people, I would have been able to do this a long time ago. <laughs> Sniper, top of the tower. Back it up, back it up. Got eyes on Matchwood. So, you're what a ghost looks like, huh? Who's our friend? 
This is the CIA gone rogue. Stole a whole lot of serious intel out of Langley. Scuttlebutt is trying to sell it to Santa Blanca. Santa Blanca? Uh-huh. If he's selling to them, what's he doing in the Unidec camp? I'm thinking he's trying to buy protection. Huh. Didn't work out too well for him, did it? He got exactly what he deserved. I got one who need that soldier. The bridge. Son of a bitch. What? You put the Langley intel on a Unidad server. Now, I can hack this. But the problem is, as soon as I open that door, we're going to have a whole lot of undesirables come looking for dangos. What do you need from me? I need you up top pulling security. Look, the problem is, is this is going to take some time. I got to hack the server, download the Langley files, and then bleach the hard drive. Look, either that shows up, you turn on the lead faucet. I love how I can't save here. But it's a total fucking mission fail if I die here. This will take a minute. They're on alert. Rally up, people. Copy that. Go to Dashford on patrol. Watch out. Shooting these guys. Doctor, get down. Sniper, get down. Matchwood, how's that hack coming along? Yeah, I'm gonna need two bikes. Faster would be better. More Uni dead incoming. We could use a hand up here. Hold your ground. I'm nearly there. Bullshit! Hurry the fuck up! Fuck! We're good to exfil. What's the RP? I'm sending the coordinates now. Did Matchwood get what he needed? Affirmative. Nomad out.
Ah! Get the fuck out of here! Now I kind of wish I got this game when the Predator DLC was out. I would have loved to have uh, experienced that bit. Guys, get on the tractor. Hang on, I'll drive. <laughs> Clear out. I'll meet you there. Oh, well, fuck you too, Sam. I might tell you you're full of shit, but I know what crybabies you sailors are. So, Woo! Um, that CIA jackass back there stole intel on a hot shit new technology. Now, he figured the cartel could use it to get its product across borders without detection. But let me tell you, it's something that's much, much more dangerous than that. You don't know what this tech is, or you're just not telling? What we've got here is the kind of war-fighting gadgets that'll put you and me out of business. And it's got the higher-up sweating bullets.
Linda, how are you doing? You're looking good, real good. It's Karen today. You look like you've clocked some miles since we last spoke. Yeah, a few. I've heard they don't make them like me anymore. There was this other guy, though. Army infiltration. He wore a bandana or something. I heard he finally retired. Really? Yep. It's only me. Sam. Yeah. You got it. I do. I'll be delivering it personally. Grim sent word. About what? Chairman of the Joint Chiefs says there's a possible empty quiver. I can get you airborne in one hour. Really? You know, a guy once said, the price of success is hard work and dedication. <laughs> Sounded like you knew a thing or two. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's good working with you, sir. Can the sir, just call me Sam. Look, you're real good at what you do. You watch your six. Huh? Archer. Come here. An hour, huh? Here you go. That's right. You got any coffee? This is Bolivia. Of course there's coffee. Finally. Ramon Felice has turned whistleblower and has revealed the existence of a child trafficking ring run by the cartel. Get to Felice and find out what he knows before El Sueño has him killed. Cheetos. Yeah, chips aren't gonna do it all for me. I'm gonna have to cook up something uh, before the end of it. Me to kill him. I was trying to go for the. I was trying to disable the vehicle.
searching this location for intel. We got company station. K-Tel. Got a typical in the area. Gracias. Gracias. Commandeering. Sorry about this, brother, but I gotta have the car. Out. I'll drive. Area of Bolivia. These outsiders have brought it upon themselves to wantonly destroy Set. the prosperity that we have built here. They kill and kidnap our compañeros. They burn our crops and destroy our mines. These outsiders are cowards, saboteurs, terrorists. And we will not tolerate their presence here. Bring me the head of... I got eyes on the Sicario leader. Let's give him a scare. Let him tell his amigos to fear us. Get that to get. Ha! Huh. Bitch! Are you afraid? Because you ought to be. Not because I might gut you and send you walking home with your intestines in your hands, but because I'm here to destroy your world. Santa Blanca will fall, will burn to ash, will crumble to dust. Go ahead, tell your compas if they survive. There's no place to run. Ha, <laughs> aguanten! Aguanten, don't hurt me! Neta, tranquis! Fucking thought. It's like I didn't put bullet in. Shit, that would have been a curse. Now everybody knows he's a punk. The rebels are gonna make his life hell. things take time, but if things go our way, the locals will give you their full backing. It cannot happen soon enough. Buena suerte. Yeah, I found details on the Nespi supply helicopter. All we have to do is hijack it and deliver it to the rebels. Simple, right? Ramon Feliz has turned whistleblower. We're good to go. He has revealed the existence of a child trafficking ring run by the cartel. Get to Feliz and find out what he knows before El Sueño has him killed.
Oh, so for, for those who are curious, I'm running this on largely um, very high uh, settings. There's a uh, high, very high, and ultra. Um, I could tell that streaming it kind of puts a hit on my range for a second, but not, but not so bad that I, I want to change things uh, differently. There we go. Their old is escaping. Fuck your mother, cabron! Easy. Camine. What's up, Justin? Oh. Yeah, I'm having a lot of fun God with it for sure. Fuck. What are you talking about? I didn't do nothing. You took a selfie with your victim, you idiot. You saw that? Fucking badass, right? Oh my that fucking god. What do you see what I do to you? Hint, it involves a wire hanger and a whole lot of electricity. Chingado, man. What do you want? Uh, you want fucking hell, man. Now. That's it? And I already dropped it off for those hacker nerds. Not far from here. Let's grab that hard drive fast before Santa Blanca wipes it. Oh yeah. I can't tell anymore right now. I'm on. Yeah. Right now I'm looking at the top corner of my game and I'm at around uh, just below 50 frames per second. So yeah, it's it's taking a lot of uh It's taking a lot to keep it going. Shit! That means an a, a Sam. They got a Sam. Bullshit. For Santa Blanca wipes it. I'll pilot. I'm on. Let's go. Spotted a cartel network station. 
Let's go fuck with their fun. Just need to blow the door and deactivate it. Banging clear. Oh, nice here we go. They've seen us. Now they'll have trouble coordinating their ops against the rebels. rigged up. Assholes are coming this way. What's the plan? Come on, come on. Bowman, you've secured Felice's hard drive. Good work. It's intact? Affirmative. You plug the key into it and are uploading the data to you now. Excellent. According to Felice's blog, Santa Blanca is snatching Bolivian children and sending them to Brazil, Argentina, and Mexico as slave labor. Now we can make his proof public. Nobody sympathizes with child traffickers, not even drug traffickers. Even drug traffickers have their moral Clear. limits. Clear. <sighs> oh, damn, that's a lot of uh, skill points.
I don't know where to go next. I can go here. I got it. I'll fly. We've awoken the fucking hornet's nest. Up, bitch. Let's like a freak get out of death card. Relax, way I'll talk. I know. I am really lucky. Awesome. I can put this to use. Fly off into the sunset. Or sunrise. Whatever.
It is a very, 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 very good, ga good looking game, by the way. <laughs> we got tango, stage or close. so the rebels can pick up the supplies later. I got mentions of a meeting between El Chido's agent and Santa Blanca lieutenants. There's no location on the meeting, but... Wait. We've got an address for the hotel where the assistant to the agent checked in for the night. Assistant to the agent? Be showbiz. I'm sure would like to bring an entourage. Makes him feel important. Whatever. Let's find this assistant. Chances are he'll lead us to his boss. Ugh. Assistant to the general manager. Wait, what weapon is that? Ooh, MK249? Alright, that's that I think that might end up being my next uh main main gun. Be dead. Oh well.
love that echo. Not too bad of a reload time for L for an LMG. Visual on Rebel Radio Broadcast Unit. Let's activate it and get their message out. And then dig in for a fight. Those things are like party invitations for SP goons. Sent. 
The rebels are gonna give Santa Blanca hell after this. See you later, Gilbert. Let's see what we can grab from that truck. Combo truck secure. We'll send the location of the radio gear to the rebels. Clear. Oh, Hang on, I'll drive. You live in when you're sober. And you know, I ain't been sober in so many fucking years. I don't even know how to answer them. Maybe neither is real. Maybe they're both real. I just talk the talk and spin the tools that make your asses bounce. What's up, Plague? What's up, Alto? Bolivia's got talent. Got data on a Santa Blanca antenna ripe for depowering. Kind of hectic. Uh, right on. Ain't nothing wrong with beer time. Uh, I'm getting kind of hungry myself. <sighs> but I tried my best to uh, stay afloat at work. Uh, that's awesome. Uh, Alto, congrats, man. Go. All right, I'm in. In Uma Marga, one night only, El Chico will be performing live at El Pachangón Boliviano. In I didn't realize I was doing the mission. Uh, 
All right. I'm going to give this a one more shot. Then uh success or failure, I I'm going to call it a call it a night. Kill the agent's PA to his boss and find out what's being planned for his upcoming concert in Nalka. You 100? That's a good question. I don't think they do. We're gonna look around here for some intel. Heads up, hostile presence. Deploying drone. I got eyes on a guy who looks like the assistant to El Cheeto's agent. What's our play? Snatching him might send up red flags to his boss. An old-fashioned tale. You see what he does and who he sees. Stay out of sight. If he makes us, we got nothing. See you later, Sulphur. Have a good one, man. No, already bought. That was not a link. I'm riding the motorcycle. What's up, Dave? Got another tango. Hold on. Looks like the assistant's stopping in this big building. The agent might be meeting its cartel contact here. We gotta hear that conversation. Think we'll have enough room to maneuver in there? We'll send in a drone and record the meet. I don't want to risk getting made. There we go. Into a meeting with Santa Blanca. The cartel people were really big on him spreading his promotional materials. There's a promo truck that'll be making the rounds of this part of Bolivia. El Cheeto's a big deal for their influence. That truck will just spread cartel propaganda. So we take out the promo truck. 
Holt loves blowing shit up. We can't just blow up the truck. There's got to be a warehouse stocking more promo materials. We swap out the truck for one loaded with C4. I'll have Pakatari's people come up with a copy of the promo truck. When that truck goes back to the warehouse full of promotional material, that's when we blow it. Sounds high risk. You already have a truck? I'll get what we need. You just need to get the truck. And keep your nose to the ground to see what else we can do to undermine the cartel's influence in the province. Got it. We'll get your truck. I don't know how they can't see me, but it is what it is. Go ahead, I'll catch up. I got a Sicario with a minigun. What, Archer? Looks like El Cheeto is giving a small concert in this village called Uma Marca. Bowman, we found out your boy El Cheeto is giving a concert at a venue in Uma Marca. They're calling the show Pachangon Valeriano. If only I could go. Oh my god! As they say, we have to make sure that concert doesn't happen. Get to that venue, do what you can to shut it down. Anything particular in mind? Just make sure the music won't happen and make sure it's something people will notice. I'll be in touch. <laughs> Oh, that's in the mine. Let's get that later. All right, breathe easy. All right, see you later, Alto. Good luck, my man. Stoner? I think I actually already have that one. I'm having a lot of fun with it, Plague. Like, a lot of fun with it. Use. 
There it is. I know, right? This document gives the route and the schedule of the convoy that's delivering El Cheeto's car here in Bolivia. Let's move. Rebels, so they can haul it out later. Right. And then for us, it's Cerveza time. Hmm. This is a goddamn fortress. What's up, Crispy? How are you, man? You're right. I feel like it's been a while since I've seen you around. How you been? Hit the dirt, helicopter. Keep going in circles. Okay. Ship off.
got school in 20 minutes? At, at night? Damn this recoil. Ow. You'll be fine, man. I'm on my way. God damn, that was close. Uh, fair enough. I figured that was gonna happen. <laughs> All right, well that's it for me. I feel like it's probably been about three hours since I started streaming this, but I'm gonna take a break. Uh, go get some food and finish up the rest of my work. So I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow and we'll go from there, okay guys? Thanks for watching. Uh, again, uh, Sulphur, thank if you're still on, thank you very much for your generosity. It was much appreciated, man. Absolutely uh, awesome. But I'll see you guys next time. Take care, y'all.